So I'm going to show you guys what happens when you buy Xbox Gold through your console. And trust me, you're not going to want to do this. <laughs> Alright, so we're just going to buy it one month just to show you guys what's up. It's bullshit. Because you're going to get forced into something that you actually don't want to do. You just want to buy a one month. Well, I'm sorry it doesn't work like that. You're actually enlisting an auto renewal every month at $10. Which is a ripoff because that's $120 a year. Alright, so we're going to do just one month. <laughs> uh, this is funny. Alright. <laughs> it says subscribe. <laughs> so it even tells you, starting today we'll charge you $9.99 every month. You'll be notified if there's any price changes. Cancel at any time. They don't tell you how to cancel. So we're going to click on view terms real quick. So what we want to know is um, how to exit out because that's what's critical about this problem. All right, here we go. Automatic renewal selection. It's all the way down at, what would this be, number 15 here. You may cancel the products or services prior to the renewal date. You must cancel before the renewal date to avoid being billed for renewal. It doesn't tell you how to cancel, though. You actually have to call them. Okay, so subscribe, which I just want to buy a one month, but I'm going to show you what happens when you buy a one month. You're actually contracting yourself at $10 a month for however long you want to keep paying that price. Bam. So now we're going to click on manage. Check this out. This is where you should have the option to choose auto renewal or not. So it asks, how do you want to change to the way you want to pay next? Which, I don't want to pay next. Add a new way to pay, which it's not going to have anything here for you to do as far as canceling out of it. They're asking for another credit card number. And PayPal. Mobile phone. I'm not going to use my phone or my PayPal or my credit card. I don't want to have auto renewal continue. You can't do this from your own console. You gotta call Xbox Live. This is a fucking scam, dude. Like, seriously, this is bullshit. <laughs> Next charge, $9.99, which is today. And then, so the next charge will be a month from now. <sighs> Whatever, we'll cancel, I just gotta call them. So that's how that works. You buy a one month, you're enlisting in auto renewal, which is the same price of what you're already being charged for, depending on what month subscription you go with. So, whatever. I just have to call them and tell them, yo, end auto renewal. Thank you. All right. So, anyways, I'm going to get back to gaming. Now that about a one month, I don't need anything else here. All right. Here we go. All righty. So the best way to buy Xbox Live is to buy it in a store like GameStop, Best Buy, Target, Walmart, and you can buy your memberships from them. And there is no automatic renewal tied to it when you buy these three month, six month, one year cards. So the three months are a little spendy. I would say the best bargain for Xbox Live cards is to buy the one year, and they're usually about 60 bucks. Or buy them on Black Friday and they're about 45 So, that's how you can buy Xbox Live without being tied into your credit card information with automatic renewal and such. So, it's a big fucking scam out there that Microsoft's running with their purchase of their monthly deals. Mm -hmm.